ain't here My heart cold, man, it's something doctors can't cure The big touch, yeah, I got my hands in it I'm about to do the dab in it What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Big Head Pat with the Big Head Pat Reviews, y'all right, today We're looking at a video, man, I think NBA young boy went a little bit too far, man um, NBA young boy is known for holding his ground, all right? He's known for holding his ground, beef with people, diss tracks, everything. He's known for it. But Jay Prince is known for a whole nother level, all right? Jay Prince is known for just being that guy, you know what I mean? In Texas, we are CEO of Rapper Lot Records. Jay Prince is like a mafia, all right? We made... He have a family. I won't say nothing else, but uh, no cartel, nothing. He have a family called, and the title is Mob Ties. All right, they have Mob Ties. If you're part of that group, you definitely good. If you don't know who Jay Prince is, um, he's somebody that a lot of people look up to. You know, especially Drake. Okay, and something happened with uh, it made Young Boy House get broken into. And, you know, Jay Prince helped, you know what I mean? And told, you know, we family, you know, I got his back, this and that. And he made your boy like that, all right? So the first video, I'm going to show you what Jay Prince did, you know, what he said, how he helped him. And then he made your boy response and Jay Prince new response that he just said to him, all right? So let's check out the first part and get into it. Let's go. Another note. On another note, while, while we was gone, uh, I got a call. Because the little homie young boy place got broke into. People went in his place, disrespected different things, and uh, you know I got a call about it. And, and the little homies that went into this place want to make that right because they understand that you know what I mean. Uh, young boy family is, is okay with me. And uh, as you can see, homie, to make a long story short, I got your keys to your Rolls Royce. I got your keys to your McLaren, you know, all that shit that they took, and the homie, Shakur, what you got, homie? You got your uh, Rolls Royce umbrellas, you got your keys, you got a bunch of other shit, so get in contact with us, bro, get your shit back, bro. All good, waiting on you. All right, so that's the first part, all right? I don't know if I should just say how I feel about it or just, you know, I'm gonna wait till we hear a young boy's response and then we can go from there, all right? Let's get to it. Hey, I don't want no friends. I don't want no new relationships. All that pussy and shit, hey, I don't respect none of that shit, man. If you got something for me, man, they got plenty of niggas around me you could call. Man, nigga, it's plenty, it's plenty ways you can get in touch with me. Man, don't get on no internet and do nothing publicly. Don't do nothing dealing with, with no fucking publicity. None of that pussy and shit. And I'm good on no, I'm good on no keys, gangster. When you buy shit cash, two two keys come with the car anyway. Man, your fucking business, man. Oh, man. All right, my input, man. NBA young boy need to grow up, man. Uh. He, he going too far. The way he talking regularly like he is, he need to calm down. I understand where he's coming from. You know, he got that tough boy mentality. So he like, he didn't want nobody know his stuff that broken into. You know what I mean? So he like, hey, just let me know the people you know and go from there. You know what I mean? And so that's that's where that came from. So now he like, why you had to do all that for a gold camera? You just call me. But I... I see it, you know what I mean? But like, you could have talked to him about that off camera, just like you just did, you know what I mean? You tried to G-check a big G, you know what I mean? So I feel like he just real disrespectful, you know what I mean? I think that's an honor, you know what I mean? To tell you the truth, if it was like me, like somebody you probably never talked to, you like, man, like this dude really just looked out, Jay Prince just looked out for me, that's crazy. So I just feel like he need to calm down a little bit, man. And cause he go start something that he don't want, he ain't gonna be able to finish. You know what I mean? Like, I understand that he just, he just, in his head, he's that guy. You know what I mean? But I think he really, really need to calm down, man, for his stuff got out of hand. Knowing that his house is in Texas, too. So, and he got, Jay Prince got a lot of pull. If you 
like look at beef in the rap game or anything that happened, if he's involved, it came out of his favor. I mean, so I think young boy need to really calm down. But I want y'all to hear the response that Jay Prince just released too. So let's get to that. Limited thinking ability and disrespectful. You're talking slick and acting like you and your brother wasn't down with me letting it be known to the mob ties community. But I talked to your brother and I believe every word he said about you knowing because he's been solid with me. I've known your brother for years and never witnessed no weak shit. So OG3, we good. But you seem to be dumber than a box of rocks. So you despise wisdom. What you should be mad about is the lie you live in. And the weak ass security being asleep in front of your house. I bet he lied to you about being asleep. That's free game. I just gave you, but it probably went over your head. Let me say this to you, little homie. You're not a friend our enemy today let's keep it that way no matter how hot it gets in Texas by the way I'm minding my business you just too dumb to know Texas is my business and I will give you whatever you ask for <sighs> that's a nice way if I'm telling you to shut the hell up bro <laughs> hey bro like you, you, you going down the wrong path, man. See, this is not Floyd. You know what I mean? How you just went off on Floyd, all this stuff, talking about him and stuff. Jay Prince is a whole different person, man. I understand that you trying to with the street cred and all this stuff and like going off what people see you as. You know what I mean? He said you're living a lot. You know what I mean? I would have just took the blessing of going to get my stuff and went on with it, man. Like, and him doing that video really showing that hey, don't mess with young boy. That's what that video was saying. Then you went in all disrespectful for no reason. And then it said like, oh, you knew about it, so now you just went in really for nothing. You did it on purpose, you know what I mean? And he telling you, man, like today it was all good. So, but like, please don't respond, man. Because if you respond, it's gonna open up a whole nother door. Like I said, this man is not like. Floyd or was it Fredo Bay? None of them, bro. You need to calm down, man. And my, on my point of this, knowing how like rap stuff goes, street stuff go, man. You need to stay in your lane. Apologize to this man and take that blessing. Your stuff get uh, get back to you. Just, that's that's really all you can say about this video. He being nice. That was a nice threat. That's what it was. He's like, bro, he's telling you to calm down. Today, you you, you not a friend or an enemy. Today. Stop. You're living a lie. So all the stuff you're talking in these raps, you're living a lie. So just chill. So I want to know what y'all think in the comments. Like, how should young boy handle this? You know what I mean? And what you think the outcome will be? You know what I mean? I don't want nobody to get hurt. You know what I mean? A lot of people love me being young boy music. He a young dude, man. Dude, young. You know what I mean? So, his mind are all together. So, hopefully, you know, Prince see that. But, you walk, you gotta, you talk, you gotta walk it, man. So, I don't know, man. I just don't want to see dude get hurt. Um, Jay Prince is just a different type of human, man. He got plugs. He got respect. That's what you say. He have a lot of respect, especially in Texas. And you living in Texas and disrespecting this man is like a suicide mission. Point blank, you know what I mean? So that's how I feel about it, y'all. You know, I don't want to go real deep into it, but I just feel that, you know, I understand when anybody young boys coming at, you know, like, hey, you could have just came to me personally about it instead of doing a video. But that video is really telling people to leave you alone. You know what I mean? So that video is kind of helping you out as a person, as a, you know, as your, uh, you know, group and everything. So, and then I tell you, like, calm down, let it go. You're not a friend, enemy. Let it be today. Like, so you do something else, it's gonna go a different way. So just let it go, bro. All right, that's how I feel, y'all. This your boy, Big Head Pat. Let me know what you know in the comments. Hey, before we go, please, y'all, like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching the video. Love y'all. Please subscribe, y'all. All right? Have a good day.
this for my kids. I do this for my mom.